Thanks so much for joining us. I'm Marcel Fontenot. The new trade truce between the United States and the European Union could mean big business for Louisiana. During a joint statement at the White House yesterday, the EU president committed to increasing purchases of American soybeans and natural gas. Two products, which industries are a major impact here in Acadiana. Our Mike Carter explains how this agreement could benefit Acadiana's oil and gas industry. It's our top story. Louisiana has been very blessed to be at the forefront of the LNG uh, export revolution. Gifford Briggs is president of the Louisiana Oil and Gas Association. I mean, we're talking over $88 billion of investment that's going on right now and, and having a, a, a new market that's being welcomed with open arms to be able to take natural gas that's converted into liquefied natural gas and export it is good news for U.S., it's good news for Louisiana, and certainly good news for the oil and gas industry. According to a 2016 study by Eurostat, 12 European nations received more than 75% of their oil and natural gas from Russian pipelines. In 2008, Russia shut off its pipelines after a dispute with Ukraine, which affected other European countries. Now, President Trump says that Russian monopoly is over. We're going to be selling LNG and we'll have to be competing with the pipeline. And I think we'll compete successfully, although there is a little advantage locationally. Here in the U.S., it's Louisiana that could be the biggest winner in this new deal. In, in a state that's blessed with an abundant of natural gas with the Haynesville Shale in North Louisiana, you know, more export capacity certainly gives us a, a larger market for the natural gas that's produced in North Louisiana, but really natural gas that's produced all around the country that comes into Louisiana that can be converted to natural gas and, and really exported all over the world. Exported through ports like Lake Charles, where Briggs says construction companies like Chenier Energy, Sempra, Venture Global, and many others have already started building LNG export facilities. We are sitting on massive energy and we are now exporters of energy. So whenever you need energy, just give us a call. In Lafayette, Mike Carter, KATC TV3. Here's Daniel's 24-hour.